So maybe you recently had one of these come across in your pocket change or someone gave one to you to add to your collection, or you have been like me and you're just always have been interested in $2 notes, but $2 bills can be really collectible, not to mention really valuable. It's kind of funny because most people don't see $2 bills on a daily basis, and since they were introduced, they have not been widely circulated in the U.S. economy at all. They were printed for the first time in 1862, and early $2 bills were way larger than the ones you see in change today. Now, there have been various types of $2 notes, from legal tender notes to national bank notes, silver certificates, treasury or coin notes, as well as the ones that we're all familiar with, which are Federal Reserve bank notes. Now, the large size notes of old carried really ornate designs and had various portraits of presidents, war heroes, inventors, and even allegorical figures of liberty. Probably one of the most popular and collectible notes are the Lazy Deuce, which is from 1875, and Educational Notes, which are from Series 1896. Originally, the treasury seal found on the note was bright red, as well as there are silver certificates with a blue seal on them. However, the most common ones that we see now have a green seal on them. So let's talk about the collectability of your Green Seal $2 note. Beginning in 1975 for Series 1976, $2 Federal Reserve notes were issued, and the Treasury Seal was changed to a Green Seal to differentiate from the legal tender notes that were previously issued. The front of this note remained the same, but on the back, the depiction was changed to the vignette of the signing of the Declaration of Independence based on the painting by John Trumbull. There are many star notes throughout these series, and these replacement notes are significantly rarer than standard production run notes, so you'll want to keep an eye out for those. Especially in older Red Seal notes, these can be very valuable. Since the $2 note was never super popular amongst collectors for a while, up until a few years ago, there's many of them out there that you can find in really good condition. You can even pick up stacks of $2 notes from your local bank. This doesn't mean every $2 bill is valuable, but it does mean that you can find valuable ones pretty readily. As I mentioned, star notes are probably the most valuable out of $2 notes, but Green Seal $2 notes had a series for 1976, 1995, 2003, 2009, 2013, and a 2017 A series. Since then, they have not been printed, as the Bureau of Engraving and Printing has decided that there is enough bills out there in the $2 line for the economical need. Again, these can have a wide range of values, but for example, a star note from the 1976 series of Green Seal notes can usually sell between $8 and $12 in very good condition. Now this bill has historical prominence for its depiction, but also due to its age and the availability of high condition notes from this series, there is usually a good premium when going to sell them. Other really good notes in this series would be fancy serial numbers, which you can see a variety of them throughout my other videos, but to touch on them, this would be like patterns such as broken ladders, birthday notes, of course star notes, as well as any other collectible pattern within the serial number. Also keep an eye out for error $2 notes. Although they are more scarce, they can be worth thousands of dollars. Let me know what you think about the $2 bills that are your favorite to collect in the comments below. I will see you there, and I'll see you in the next video.